Hey guys, and welcome to another dungeon boss guide. Today's boss is Prince Caliban within the Imperian Core Storm Legion Expert Dungeon. This is the last boss within the dungeon, and I will be showing you through the DPS perspective. So, the mechanics of this boss are very easy. You just need to make sure that you are awake and aware of what is going on. The first mechanic, as pretty much always, stay out of the AoEs on the floor. This includes the green gas, but also another AoE, which is a frontal attack from the boss itself, which you can see with a red triangle. Make sure you stay out of both of these, else you'll most likely die. Um, so, just make sure you stay out of all of the AoEs on the floor. Vitality Leech is a channeled skill that the boss uses, and this will just deal damage over time to a selected player. Uh, but take note that this can be interrupted, and probably should be, just to make the healer's job slightly easier, or just leave it if you hate the fucker. <laughs> Trample is the next ability. Basically, the boss will call out a name, saying Prince Caliban glares at Rogue's Abyss, for example. After calling that, he will charge up a pounce, and sprint directly at where you were standing when he called it. All you have to do is get as far away as possible from that point, um, and I will be showing this in the clip after. Although he doesn't call out my name, um, there, is, there is one point where I have to sprint away because I was in line with uh, the other person that he called it with. And the last thing is that the boss will blast everyone into the walls occasionally. If you hit a blue core that is on the wall, it will explode and deal a bit of damage. So either try to avoid being in line with the cores, or just leave it because it shouldn't deal too much damage and the healer should be able to cope with it. Other than that, just DPS the shit out of the boss. And I'll now show you a clip of me completing it. And I'm in my wrong spec, but ah well. Doesn't really matter. So, as I said earlier, this boss is pretty easy. Just avoid the AoEs. Um, and then, if he shouts out your name, just run the fuck away from where you are standing because he will charge at you like a boss. Uh, so this guy here, he's going to absolutely sprint, I hope, away from his original position. Yeah, and the boss will just sprint um, at where he was originally. So, the mechanics are very easy. You've just got to be aware of what's happening. Um, stay out of the red AoEs and everything else, and you should be fine. I mean, there's not exactly much to do. Just keep moving when you need to. <laughs> and that's it. Just keep DPSing the boss down. Make sure you stay out of the red AoEs so don't stand in front of the boss. So now that guy should be absolutely sprinting. Yep, no. Oh, that's oh, alright, it was our tank anyway, so it didn't really matter. Um, not sure what happened there, I think probably an aggro loss. Oh, I'll just spam this now. You can interrupt that one, so I'll do that. So now he should be sprinting, so should I, because that's where his position was. So you've just got to be aware of what's actually going on. And there's the boss down. Nice and easy. And we got some awesome loot as well. And there we have it. In my opinion, it's a nice and easy boss and you can get some awesome loot from it as I did. Hopefully this guide has helped some of you to understand how this boss is completed. And if it did, please leave a like below. As always, please leave any constructive criticism uh, below as well in the comment section and please subscribe if you wish to see more guides or just more videos from me. Thanks for watching and have an awesome day.